Good afternoon, everyone. This is Matt over at MilestoneCapitalGrowthPortfolio.com. Today is Monday, June 6th. Sorry about the frogs in the background. That's what happens when tree frogs uh, get rolling here. They're pretty loud. Okay, uh, I want to take a look at Google here. Google has some issues, and uh, it's been a great uh, great move to the downside. Uh, it's trying to, consol tried to consolidate higher. Uh, it's still stuck in a trade zone right now. Uh, if you work off of this, uh, this angle here, and this is the daily chart, by the way, um, you can see this is the top side over here and if you look at the bottom side the bottom side is down here so uh, typically this is the move 720 to 760 uh, should be next um, you know just have to see if it's going to break this 200 SMA uh, it has it has the other times so uh, no no reason why it won't this time but um, you know if you're following my trade you're in this one already and uh, you're making money on it but uh, but uh, you know, looking at the daily here, it looks pretty easy to uh, come down and get this. Uh, I would first probably watch this area first, right, with a base of these candles arcs. That'll be the most important. Uh, then, if it breaks that, then I would move to the wick. So pretty much the 200 in that area. It looks like you're going to get some stability right around 723. Uh, if that happens to break, then uh, we should be hitting south on that. Now, looking at the uh, longer term time frame, you can see the weekly. Uh, you have two weeks here that are, uh, you know, this week's red here, and if you drop these trend lines a little bit more, uh, you can see you can manage right off of that. Here's a 50-day on the weekly chart. Uh, it'll fall right into line with that, and that's coming in. You know, we could get that candle close of the week at 7.13, somewhere in that area, but you have to manage those trend line areas. And you can see the monthly. Uh, if it does hit that 7.13 area, you could see the uh, EMA 8 uh, is 7.2504, so it'll be under that. And then uh, if this really falls apart for the for the rest of this month uh, look for it to head down and test the 651 uh, but one step at a time but as you can see your stows getting ready to roll down uh, which really doesn't mean too much your stows getting ready to cross here your MACD is getting ready to roll down and your scatastics is, is heading down so uh, Google might have some more inner um, but you're coming into a little bit of a base here uh, could to get might get a little bit of a pop the hourly is still uh, it, once it gets up to this EMA 8 can't break it or get up to the middle Bollinger Band still trending to the downside so uh, watch this baby uh, finish up moving to the downside um, or play the bounce uh, on this but you can see on the uh, daily the 200 is right here so definitely keep an eye on that at 725.67 that'll be five days red five days red which is uh, pretty red so uh, that's my look on uh, Google Google looks like it's heading down you can see your MACD is getting right across to the downside very bearish uh, could get a couple of epic candles here to uh, to finish out this uh, lower bowl in Japan move this week which would be about uh, 712 we'll have to see what happens um, with this but uh, it's definitely on track with the middle bowl in Japan being broken today all right everyone this is Matt over milestone if you'd like to follow my trades uh, I will alert my trades to you. You will get them sent directly to your phone if you have WhatsApp, uh, and I do option trades. So uh, just click on the link in the video, and you can uh, find us there, and we'll get you all set up uh, to start receiving our live alerts. Have yourself a fantastic night. This is Matt over at MilestoneCapitalGrowthPortfolio.com.